What's up? Yeah. What's up, Gus? What do you got to say to YouTube? Well, first of all, I want to tell everybody, hope you had a great Thanksgiving. You know, I hope your uncle got drunk enough to say, I don't think that works on me. And you prove him wrong. <laughs> it actually did happen. One of my friends told me that. Why? While we were cooking, making the food? He's like, is that really Put my beard down. Put your beard up. Oh, oh damn! Oh, damn. They recognize him, man. He's a full grown man. How do you know this guy? I remember this guy when he used to roll up his, his gi. He used to be this small. Man, he was, yeah, he used to be this small, bro. When I first met him. Almost eight years ago. And now he's taller than you. Got the Justin Bieber going on. Look at him. Look at him, man. Hey, there you go. I got the just. Where's your sister at? Huh? Your sister, what's up? Is she here? Yeah, you gotta put the mic up here, bro. Oh, wow! Thanks, honey! Oh, my God, you got so big! Wow, you're so old. Thank you. Man, trust me, we've got two other ones. Oh, I gotta put the microphone here? Yeah. Microphone check, one, two, one, two. You know what time it is? Arm lock, leg locks. Hill hooks. Did you watch that movie Bruised yet? What? Bruised, the movie Bruised. No. What's it about? It's about um, the one that you're recommending. You're kind of like. Uh, the, I mean, the thought process of the of Jitsu is there, but they didn't really take the time to break it down. Just like um, what's that other Jitsu movie? Red Choke. Choke. I didn't see that one. The one that's good, Red Belt. That's okay, Red Belt. No, you gotta see that one with it's, uh, with Hicks and Gracie. Say hello to Mr. Red Belt's good. Um, a good one, a good documentary on YouTube is Roll. Yeah. Gotta watch that, man. Show gotta watch Show that. Is better. Show I'm gonna have to watch that one. But Bruce, um, what's her name? Halle Berry comes out in it. Halle Berry? I believe that's her. I believe it's her. You mean Gabby Garcia? No, she comes on it too. Gabby Garcia comes on there. I mean, it, it was cute. The little heel hook she threw in there. That was cute. That was cute. That was cute. Or Israel, where they do jujitsu for PE now? No, that's United Emirates. Uh, there you go. <laughs> we just found out that Kai's a, a, a tight bicep. <laughs> Thai bison. <laughs> you gonna go to Mexico and open a Thai restaurant? It's called fusion, okay? Step, it can be a little jab step, okay? Here, look at his feet, boom. As he enters, lowers his weight. Double. That's it, here, boom, boom. And you switch. Just do a couple here. Well, that's it. Here, go. Boom. That's how it should look. Just nice and smooth here. Boom. Try to catch a little timing and rhythm of it. Find your own rhythm, find your own timing. Okay? Just back and forth. Okay? You guys got it? Yeah. Let's go. Ready? One, two, three. Let's go. So as we're walking, you know how we're starting to walk now. Now as we're moving and I go here, boom. See that? Once he's trying to keep distance to try to set something up, okay, you're already moving. Boom, boom. Right? Here. See? So here. You guys got it? So it's the same, same arm drag. We're just, it, the entrance is different. So we're basing it off of not, before we were just going like this and little John was just going. Like that. Simple, right? But now this one is as we're going, I'm trying to block him. Circle, still controlling the wrist, you see that? He's circling the hand to control, to pass it to that hand. So watch how he does it again, he circles, now pulls it, see? He's still guiding it this way, still controlling. Now he pulls, step, boom. There it is, yeah? Okay. Let's go, guys. 
Ready? One, two, three. Go. We're gonna go over a choke that a lot of people try, but um, I don't know what the hell. One more. Uh, right there. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go north south, right? But then we're gonna do some some adjustments. So when you feed your north south, I don't really lock up my hands. I just leave this forward, like up, like this. So I leave his head bridged on my forearm, okay? So when I'm here like this, when I transition, I can step over and staple this arm, but I kind of just use the fat guy uh, ass on the, on the arm. So I go here like this, and I just sit through, boom, like that. Rotate through. Now, when I'm here, uh, come around. Right there. So when I get here like this, I make my adjustments so my armpit is in his neck. Or on his, my shoulder is like on his chest and my armpit is in his neck. Now I'm feeding this one through, just knifing it through, okay? So my hand is just like up like this, okay? Now this hand, I'm burying myself down, okay? I'm pushing his shoulder, that's why I leave this hand free. I push, oh sorry. Jeez. I'm burying myself here and I'm pushing his shoulder down as I'm squeezing and elongating his neck. <laughs> Are you elongating him with your shoulder? No, so what I'm trying to do is trying to get this right here. It's almost similar to the way Anthony showed us that uh, the, head and the head and arm triangle, right? It's different. It's not pushing in right here. It's dropping down and then sliding back, like constricting. So it's starting here. My shoulder is here, my armpit is like right here, and I'm driving down, and then my hand is pushing them into like right that position, kind of. I'm not, go I'm not trying to go on his neck. I can't be on his neck, right? Because it's not gonna work, okay? So the transition is easy, okay? It's just here, I overhook like this, and I sit, boom. Now once I'm there, I rotate, and then now I start making my adjustments. I start going here, and start moving so I can get, I it's a feel thing because your armpit has got to be in that right pocket. If his chin is down, you have to start wiggling and move. Now, my free hand, I'm pushing on his shoulder down as I'm scooting back, keeping my head like this, here. And then I start squeezing. Okay, I want to like, I'm here, I want to push him away from me like that. Here. Okay. Do you smile like Marcelo when he does it? What do you mean? You know oh, Marcelo shit. Does it? No, that guy's a, <laughs> a freak at it. But let's try, um, let's try that and let me know and then we'll go to the next step from there, okay? Let's work that. Transition, step over here, shoulder down, elongating yourself, okay? So even here too, you gotta like, it's almost like a, like a guillotine. It's almost like you're here clamping down and you're still giving that squeeze like that, okay? You guys got it? All right, let's go, ready? One, two, three. <laughs> Let me see your hall pass. I need a sign. Otherwise, Angie's gonna come tear this place up. So I need a, I need an official, and it's gotta have Angie's stamp. It's gotta have her right thumbprint. A Don seal of approval. What's up, champ? Hey, we need help. All right, let's see. I know, man. Let's go. Let's see.
Fancy. All right, guys, let's go. Grab a partner, guys. Partner, partner, partner. Let's go. Feet on the hips. Here. Shrimp. Top leg. And then switch on your own. No, no, you're going to just block with one hand. Knees to your chest. Up. Doesn't matter which one you do. Switch it up on, the, on your own. Here. Shrimp. Guard retention stuff. Okay? When you guys are ready, on your own. Circle. You can go this way. Or one foot down, one foot up. Follow your partner. Now you don't have to keep switching. No, just one here. Yeah. What do you mean by one? You want the feet. Yeah. Here. I meant one foot down, one foot up. So the reason why you go one foot down, one foot up is if I'm going really fast, you're faster this way. The other way with both feet up, okay, you could do this. But sometimes when I go faster, he gets left behind. Okay, so it's almost better to one foot down here. When I enter in here, lock. Boom. You guys got it? All right, let's go for time and switch. Ready? One, two, three. What we're going to do is we're going to push to initiate the open, okay? So we're going to come here, push, and our knees come in, and our feet go to the hips like that. Once you're there, you're going to kind of widen your shins till they get to the crook of the elbow right there. So what that does, it keeps tension so he can't like use his arms to start dumping you up, uh, back and forth, okay? So now what you're gonna do is you're gonna walk your legs back right here, okay? And what you're gonna do is keep it, we're gonna just go here like this. You're gonna fake, faint the uh, spider here and then just pull straight into your triangle, okay? Now you're gonna lift your hips here, pass. Shin, go, uh, hand comes up to the shin, foot to the hip, turn the angle. Up here. Remember, when you squeeze your knees, which way do they squeeze? You guys remember? It goes in like that. Here, yep. Don't go straight down like this and don't have your foot like that. Okay? So when you're shooting, you want to come over here so your foot is vertical. This one's vertical here. Driving your heels down. Boom. And your knees go in. Sorry. Okay? Okay, so here, here, walking your shoulders back here, like you're going here, and then you're gonna drop, and then you're gonna pull, boom, just like that. Even if I'm not completely there, and my feet are locked, then I start bringing him to me, like that, I just by bringing my knees in. Now I'm up, past the arm, shin, foot to the hip, turn, and then your knees go in like a isosceles triangle, right? Like that, it's still going down, okay? Now, um, from there, okay, same thing. You're gonna go to the same, same triangle set up here, okay? Now, when you, once you finish, once your partner taps, okay? Here, tap, I want you to change again, one, here, and then tap right there. Okay, so it's an arm bar right here. Different variation, okay? Now, uh, the third one, okay, here. Okay, same entry, here, walking your shoulders back, here, get into this position here, now I pull this way, now I go over, up, walk them sideways. Okay, basic omoplata stuff, okay? You guys got that? Let's start working those three submissions before we start carrying on to, to other stuff, okay? Make sure everybody's good with that. You guys got it? All right, let's go, ready? One, two, three. So from your De La Hiba, okay, we're gonna stretch them out. Drop the, drop the De La Hiba hook, right? Uh, turn this way a little bit. Here, sit up, here, pass, right? Now, once I'm grabbing at the collar here, okay, we're gonna go straight to the advanced stuff, okay? So he's gonna post here. Now what I'm gonna do, just similar to the, the collar drag stuff that we did with Cobrinha, right? It's the same thing. My feet switch, but now this time I'm punching down. Up, boom, he's here. Now once I'm here, I can either, 
Um, what I want you guys to do is cut in between his legs here, folder. Because you already have his sleeve, so now it's easier to go folder here, okay? Second one, we're gonna stretch him out, okay? Same thing, pass, here, he's gonna post, okay? Now, block, switch, shin on shin, then I scoot up, kick down, kick up, here. Okay, you guys remember that one? Yeah. Can we see it? Yeah. Here, De La Hiva. stretch him out and pull in here. Pass, grab, make his hand touch the ground, okay? Blocking the tricep, elbow goes down, watch how my feet swivel, okay? I shrimp, or you flexible people can put the hook in right away. Now I'm gonna scoot up to make it tight. Kick down, one, two, here. You guys got that? So let's start right there before we uh, keep going on, okay? You good? All right, let's go. Ready? One, two, three. Okay. So here. Pull up. Here. Walk, walk, walk. Down. Switch. As he's coming up. Boom. Catch. Here. Slide my knees back. Finish. Here. Work the hooks. Control, control. Here. Hey, what's what's the, uh, the little secret to that arm bar? Because I've gotten people in that position, crucifix, and, yeah. I, and I can't get in the, I can't lock that arm out. Right. So when you snap, you have to <coughs> so we can't get in there. So when you get here like this, what you want to do, okay, it's typically with the top foot here. So you want to snatch here and stay in position right here. Pinch your knees here. Now what I'm doing, I'm sliding my knees backwards. Here. Mm. So hips go down. Now if I feel his wrist in my left leg, I want to tilt my hips forward. If I feel his wrist in the right side here, go here and then go back. Mm. So it's a feel thing. Yeah. Don't let his wrist, don't let his wrist get into the crook of your knee. But because typically what happens, that's kind of where if you spar your legs too far back, the arms, the, the wrist is gonna slip out. So everywhere, if it's here, the back of my knee, I keep it there. And I use my hips to finish it. By stretching out and back, that's kind of how I finish it. Okay. So let's stay with those two and then uh, if we get the time, we'll move on from there, okay? Let's go, ready? One, two, three. What's up, Kendra? You excited for your tournament this weekend? Yeah. Feel ready? A little bit. A little bit? Actually, a lot. You feel a lot ready? No, no. You've been working hard for like the last month? Yeah, I think after tomorrow's training, I'll know. I was gonna end my back, which I did anyways. Yeah, but you, uh, but you immediately sna you immediately snagged a path though, like you should have. So that was perfect. Worked from half into close. Great job. Yes. Yes. You were trying to do that, the trip. You were trying to do. I did try the trip, it didn't work. Yeah. I'll work on that for. No, the the sweep that put you back on top. I don't think they counted it. They they might have counted it as a. Just like in the back right here. As soon as the whistle goes up, the mindset changes. They they have a medic inside. That. Yeah. Yeah. Do you want me to take your stuff? I'm gonna take your let's take your uh take your jacket off. 
That way you're not sweating. Don't take your metal. And wear, and wear that thing around for a while. <laughs> yeah.